You may remember this piece of cherry from a previous video. I rough turned a whole bunch of cherry blanks and I took some inside to dry. This has been sitting inside for three months, almost exactly three months. It's about three quarters of an inch thick, so I'm gonna take a gamble that this is air dry enough to finish term. It was quite dry in there over the winter because it was exceptionally cold this year for an extended period of time and the air was quite dry. Plus it's air conditioned so the moisture inside was quite low. So that's why I decided to try to final turn this. Fortunately there was this large void inside and it's deep enough that if I was to take this tenon off it'll probably show through actually and be a hole. So what I'm gonna try to do is I'm going to try to put a boxy in there. Haven't done this before? Experimenting. That's what Kami's crowd is all about. As suspected, I mean too much. Well, while we're at it, since I have plenty here, I have this thing that I wanted to try to put some epoxy in there. I'm not sure this will be enough. Just in case this leaks, I suspect it will, I'm going to put it inside this little steel container. Well, it didn't fill up the hole completely. Finally got a use for this, so we'll just let these cure overnight. So this cured for more than 24 hours now. Nice and hard. I was just thinking about how I'm going to put this back on the lathe and I think I'm going to sand this flat with the sanding disc and glue it to a waste block and then final turn it. I'm excited. So as you can see, this turned out really, really nice. Just love this figure that's in this crotch piece. There's some checking in the sapwood here from the drying. I don't think it detracts too much from the piece. The epoxy looks all right. It tore out a little bit around the edges from the turning. But overall, I'm quite happy with the result. And I have more where this came from in Kami's garage.